Hi guys, I'm Gordon Reed, Creative Director from Middle Boop Studios, and today we'll be using the Freeform Gradient tool and the new Global Edit tool. So let's get started. So first, we're going to look at the new Freeform Gradient tool, which can be located in your properties, just next to the Linear and Radial Gradient. Whereas before, with previous builds of Illustrator, you were a little bit restricted with what you could do with the gradient. You just had the linear and the radial, whereas now we have a lot more options to really create that perfect gradient. So you see here with these points, you can drag these points and it will edit the, that particular color. You can drag them, you can make them bigger, just edit them however you want. Now let's get rid of this color because I don't think we need all four colors. But also, what you can also do with this tool is if you double click it, you can also change the colors as well. Tweak the tones just to make sure you get that perfect gradient. So let's pull in the white, Dr click and drag just to bring those colors in a little bit more. And then maybe just tweak a little bit more of the color as well just to get it working perfectly for you. The next trick is the global edit tool, which is just, again, in properties, under quick actions, and you just click start global edit here. Now this is a great tool if you've got multiple artboards like I have here for just tweaking certain elements. Once clicking that global edit button, you can edit anything in your artboards and it will edit all three. We can also recolor. So if we move back over to the global edit tool, we're still under global editing at the moment. Let's do, let's recolor that just to get everything perfect in the document. And you'll see here, once we've changed that color, it changes it for all three artboards. 